Hi everyone, I'm Elijah. Welcome to Music Greatness. For today's lesson, I'm going to break down Cosmic Girl. It sounds just like this. Alright, for this part I'm going to break down the intro and also the pattern we're going to use for the verses in the song. We're playing in the key of E minor, but later in the chorus we're going to switch and play in the key of C sharp minor. Okay, so for the chords of the intro and verse, we're starting with E minor 7. With E on the left, B, D, E and G right hand. And then, for the next chord, we're simply going to move everything up by one whole step to play F sharp minor 7. F sharp on the left, C sharp, E, F sharp and A. And then after that, we're going to play several chords on B, starting with this one. That's B7 augmented with a flat 9. So B on the left, and right hand plays D sharp, G, A, and C. After that, we have B augmented. B on the left, right hand plays D sharp, G, and B. And then finally, we have B7 augmented, now with a sharp 9. So, B for the left, D sharp, G, A and D, on top for the right hand. One, two, three, four, one. One. So, for the intro, we're only going to use the right hand. And we're going to start by playing E minor 7 four times, counting in 16th notes. So, 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and. Okay? So, four times for E minor 7. And we're going to do that on the A uh of the first beat, the AND of the second, the E of the third, and also on the fourth beat. So, one E and, two E and, three E and, four E and. Again, one E and, two E and, three E and, four E and. Then we have three times for F sharp minor seven. And we're going to play that on the A uh of the fourth beat, the AND of the first for the next measure, and the E of the second. So from the top, 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and, 1 E and, 2 E and. Again, 2, 3, 4. 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and, 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and. So coming up next, we're going to play B7 augmented with the flat 9 on the 3rd beat and also on the end of the 3rd beat. 3 E and, 4 E. And, and then on the E of the fourth beat, 
we're going to switch to B augmented. 3 E and 4 E and. From the top. 2, 3, 4. 1 E and. 2 E and. 3 E and. 4 E and. 1 E and. 2 E and. 3 E and. 4 E and. So that's the rhythm we're going to use for the right hand. Let's play that a little bit faster. Two, three, four. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. So that's what we're going to play and repeat for the intro. Here it is. Three, four. Okay, so on the last time playing it, after repeating it four times, instead of playing this, we're going to play B7 augmented with a sharp 9, going to B7 augmented with a flat 9, like this. 3 E and 4 E and. So after playing this pattern four times, here it is again. 2, 3, 4, 1. Two, three, and four. And that's all you have to do to play the intro. Okay, now let's move on to the pattern of the verse. We're simply going to add a bass line on the left. Very simple bass line, we have this. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one. So I'm going to play E on the first beat on my left, and then I'm going to stay there for the entire measure. And after that, I'm going to switch on the first beat of the next measure to F sharp. And then on the third beat, I'm going to switch again to B, down here. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Now we only have to combine the pattern of the right hand and the pattern on the left. It goes like this. Two, three, four. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. Two, three, four. One, 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 two, three, four. So just like the intro, after playing it four times, we're going to change the chords on B. Okay? And then for the verse, we simply have to repeat again. Two. Three. all you have to do. Again, we're going to use this pattern for the verse for all the verses in the song. So verse 1 and verse 2 are exactly the same. After that, we're going to take a look at the chorus, and that's in part 2. For now, let's recap.
And that's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.